How many times do you think I've dressed up like you? <laughs> do you want to wait? What? The past few times that I've seen her, it has literally just been her like shooting across the room. I'm not gonna lie, guys, he kind of creeps me out sometimes. He liked them. Okay. Did Lola just say you sh? After us. <laughs> Before we get into this video, I just want to remind you to go get your exclusive third eye hoodie. It does have my signature, and the sleeves are so cute, perfect for spooky season. Then the back has my favorite manifestation quote, what I seek seeks me. And if you get one of these hoodies, post a picture on social media of you wearing it, tag me, and I will feature your photo in an upcoming video. Which reminds me, we have three features for this video. We have Anna, who was looking so zen in her hoodie. So, so cute. Kate Bailey, so gorgeous. And Miguela Jimenez with the Possibly Haunted doll. Huge shout out to them. Thank you guys so, so much for supporting me. Also reminding you that the Lola plush toys are available. The links are down below in the description. You can also find them in the merchandise section. Now let's get into the video. I just raise you that one. Hey, Calcats, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, my name is Kelsey Davies. Today, we have a very special video planned. I haven't done one of these in a hot minute because your girl has been traveling all over this year and I haven't had time to do one. But I'm bringing it back, gonna be asking my haunted doll some more questions this October. Get ready. I have so much content coming for you guys, you have no idea. I've been stressed, but it's all gonna be okay. I'm hanging in there. I'm hanging in there. We're hanging in. I thought that it would be very interesting if I asked my haunted doll some questions dressed as her ghost. Okay, but seriously, I actually wanna know what she thinks of me dressing up as her ghost, like, a lot. As well as the other spirits in my apartment. This one's long overdue. In case you guys are new here, Lola was born in 1901. She passed away in 1919 from the Spanish flu pandemic. She was 18 years old when she passed away in her bed. I always see her in a white nightgown, very similar to this one. Her hair's down and it's super curly. My boyfriend has also seen her spirit as well when he used to be a skeptic. So that says a lot of things. But she's a very kind spirit. She chose to attach to this doll because the doll looks looks a lot like her. If you wanna know more about her, there are plenty of videos on my channel that you can go watch and binge. Binge Lola, she's worth it. She's an icon. The link to the Spirit Box app I use is down below in the description. Lola, can you cross the rods in my hands if you are ready to go? She's ready. Lola, does it offend you that I dress like you sometimes? No. Okay, that's good. I heard silly. She thinks it's silly. Do you think that it's silly what I do when I dress like you? Yeah, she giggled. <laughs> do you think that I did a good job picking out the nightgown? Yes. Do you think the other spirits might get upset that I dress up like them? That usually means she does not know. How many times do you think I've dressed up like you? <laughs> do you want to wait? What? <laughs> I don't think it was that many times. Lola got jokes. <laughs> what do you think when I twerk as you? Do you think it's hot? Would you like me to do it right now? <laughs> Lola, if I twerk as you, you gotta do it with me, all right? Yes. yes. The doll. Oh. Did I just walk in? <laughs> you think that was funny? Who delivered your dad? <laughs> Almost peed my pants. I went sprinting into the gate. I tapped it on the thing and flung the gate open, and I ran over to the pool bathroom like, whoosh, whoosh, whoosh. I almost knocked some dude over. I literally almost peed myself. I was going like this, my, my shorts, I was like this. 
I've never been that close. Oh, I have. I've never. shit myself too. Did Lola just say you shit after I said that? <laughs> <laughs> All right, now this has turned into a confession time. Lola, have you seen me pooping on the toilet? She's laughing. She's laughing. Have you watched me take a duty? Yes. yes. <laughs> I mean, you the door wide open. That's true, I do. Lola, should I shut the door more often? <laughs> yes. Now I'm going to ask Pauline what she thinks when I dress as her. All right, I'm calling out to Pauline. Lola, if you can go get Pauline for me, I'd really appreciate it. I have to know what Pauline thinks of me uh, dressing like her. The past few times that I've seen her, it has literally just been her like shooting across the room. Let's hope we get some communication with Pauline rather than just a graceful hover. Pauline, are you here? Yes, yes, I heard that. Hello. It's been a long time since I've talked with you. Why are you always in such a hurry? Are you able to cross the rods in my hands? I see you. There we go. Thank you. Is there a reason why you're always in such a hurry? I don't think she's sure as to what I mean. Am I just catching you at a glimpse when you're traveling? Pauline, are you ever offended when I dress up like you? No? I keep seeing her like by the stairs. Can someone point to where Pauline is right now in the room? Oh, did you see me dancing today as you? Yes. Oh God. Did you like my dance moves? Oh, I just saw her like rush that way again. Now we have to see how Emil feels about me dressing up like him. He's always so sad. I'm not gonna lie guys, he kind of creeps me out sometimes. I always see him just like this. He just looks so sad all the time. Oh, Drew said he always, wait, come here. Come join me, darling. He'll pop around the corner like this. Yeah. <laughs> no, he's like kind of creepy. He always peeks out at Drew and then he just stands by the I, TV. I'll be sitting on the couch and I see him out of the corner of my eye and before I can actually look, he goes. <laughs> Whenever I'm watching TV, he'll stand by the TV, like, cause his statue's right here. He'll just stand by it and like with his head down. <laughs> just a normal day with our family, right? And then the cats will <laughs> stare up. They'll hear somebody. <laughs> like that? Like this. They'll literally be walking and they go. No, they do. And then I look too and we all look together. All you hear is. Yeah. And they'll go like this. Emil, are you here? Oh, bonjour. He's from France. Emil, are you feeling okay today? Something about Santo. I don't know if you, I can't figure out if you like being called Santo or Emil. I heard Santo, but he said he likes Emil better, so I'm a little confused. Unless that was someone else. Lola, was that you who called him Santo? Okay, that's what I thought. I think he prefers a meal. Yeah, a meal. Do you prefer I call you a meal? Yes, a meal. Okay. A meal, does me dressing like you offend you in any way? No, that's good. Okay, I thought one of them was at least gonna be like a little upset. Did you see the dance moves I did today? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> did you like them? He liked them. Okay. Yours were kind of cool. I kind of did this like cool little 
head thing with you. Sometimes he has a hat on, sometimes he doesn't. Depends on the day, I guess. Yes. No hat right now. Okay, I understand. Well, I appreciate you coming forward and talking with me. Merci. Oh, thank you, Emil. We got some French. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know if you want more like this one of me talking to the spirits in my apartment. Make sure you are subscribed. Also, hit that notification bell so that you guys know when I post. And I will see you in the next video. I mean, I mean, we will see you in the next video.